Kia ora So I've just defrosted all the um, cheese sauce, chucked all the juice from the um, cooked up chicken and bacon. So juice gave it a bit of flavouring. And now, I'm just chucking whatever extra cheese I've got left in the, um, in the fridge. Just a bit of gruyere in there and a bit of cheddar. And this is piping hot now. So we're just um, mixing it around. I've also cooked my spaghetti pasta for eight minutes in salted hot boiling water. Um, and that's just draining off as we speak. And then because this is so hot, I'll just grab the um, spaghetti. Okay, so I put the hot spaghetti there back into the pot after I drained it. Oh, and that's very hot. And then all I'm going to do now is a hot thing of pasta. Get rid of my um, spatula. Ah, uh, sorry, my foot. And then we're going to this extra cheesy sauce into the pasta keep the whole bowl really hot take that all in make sure you get every bit so that's flavoured white sauce with different types of cheeses and um, cooking juice when I fried off the chicken and the bacon just a nice flavour to it now and in there I've got some um, leftover baby spinach leaves. They're still pretty good. So chucking them in there because to give it a bit of colour. Let's have a look inside. And I'm just washing those down with the heat of the pasta and um, the cheese sauce. Right, and then Here is my cooked um, bacon and chicken, and that goes straight into the creamy pasta dish with all the rest of the juices. And I get my big sturdy wooden spoon, and I just mix, mix it around far enough. You can see in the top there. Just mixing around um, the spaghetti. chicken, the bacon and the um, baby spinach. I'll put it back on the stove to let all those flavours meld in and then it's ready to eat. See you soon, whānau.